this thing <laughs> How to pass exams without studying? <laughs> my wish and my blessing <laughs> is… My wish and my blessing is you should not pass. Because when you say how to pass an examination without studying, what you are saying is how to get a certificate without knowing a damn thing about anything. So if you become a doctor, without knowing what you should know, you passed and became a doctor. We don't know how many lives you will take. Without studying or without knowing what you should know, you became an engineer. You build the Kolkata bridge <laughs> Before anybody crosses on that bridge, it collapses on people's heads, taking lives. We don't know what other disasters you will cause. What has happened to you is just this. You have empowered your ego and enhanced your desire. Now, what you need to do is this. You need to empower your intelligence and enhance your competence. This is what you need to do. This is what education is about, this is what life is about. But unfortunately, you think education is about passing an examination. Education is not about passing an examination. Education is about learning. It looks like the world has forgotten about this. So those who want to pass examinations without studying, those who want to win without playing the game, those who want to be honored for things that they have not done, these people will achieve one thing, they will die without living. This one thing they will achieve, because if you want to live, you must involve, you must empower your intelligence and competence. In doing something to the best of your ability, there is fulfillment in this, there is joy in this, there is life in this. In passing an examination without studying, in winning a game without playing, in being honored without deserving, there is only ego satisfaction looking around at people who have failed and feeling little better than them. As I said, for sure you will die without living. If you think passing an examination without studying is a success, dying without living is definitely a super success and you will succeed. What? Narendra Singh, Dhoni <laughs> or Modi? <laughs> no. Nah. This is champion of everything. One who wants to pass examination without studying is a champion of everything. If you are a champion of everything, you are a nutcase. If you are a champion in something, there is enormous striving in becoming a champion of something. You are a champion of everything because you are a nutcase. And when you become a champion of everything, it means you don't know how to do anything. Yes? You don't know how to do anything. <laughs> Narendra Singh <laughs> It's my wish and my blessing. All those who don't study must fail. All those 
who do not know how to play must lose. Yes? yes? All those who do not deserve are not honored in this world. This is my wish, this is my blessing. So you just came to the wrong guy. <laughs> there are people who will bless you. Don't worry, don't study, my blessing is there, you will pass. I am not one of them. You just came to the wrong place. <laughs> what? Champion of everything? Hmm? If you become no, that's good. If you want to be champion of everything, life will get you in so many different ways. If you fail, it's good, at least you know you are not fit enough to take the next step. Yes or no? Yes. If you lose a game, you know that you are not good enough. Yes or no? Yes. That is the idea of failure. That is the idea of passing and failing, that to know whether I am fit enough to take the next step or not, not to fool the world. You can fool the world, but the problem is you will become such an expert and you, you will f make a fool of yourself. That's the biggest problem. So Narendra Singh, <laughs> not Dhoni, not Modi, <laughs> there's enormous striving behind those names. <laughs> Let's leave it here, otherwise I'll get more nasty. Because I don't like people who pass without studying. <laughs>